because I can fix that. Ah, it just got so much brighter. Hold on. Okay. I going live actually scares me. Um, but I'm gonna post on my Instagram that I just went live. Because or else I guess no one would know unless I think it sends you guys a notification. I'm pretty sure when I go on live. But let me post. It's like a I'm so confused. I don't really know what I'm doing, honestly. Okay, so is my service fine? If you guys can see it, please let me know. <laughs> I think it's fine. I mean, it looks fine to me, but maybe not. Anywho, uh, hi guys. I'm eventually gonna actually upload this as a normal video. So, hi guys, um, and happy vlogging. Day 15. Today I wanted to kind of come on live because I am leaving for the airport in about soon. I don't really know exactly when, but I'm leaving for the airport really soon. So I wanted to just come on live. It's a lot. It just made more sense for me to do this today. Um, so that's what I'm going to do. And I wanted to tell you guys kind of like the makeup that I use every single day. Clearly I have not on right now. We know. But Normally when I'm filming and doing anything, this is the makeup that I normally have on. Obviously I'm not doing like a makeup tutorial. Trust me, none of you want that, like at all. But I am doing, like just showing you the makeup that I use kind of like every single day. So first off, well I have so much stuff in my lap. First off, um, I got the Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson collab makeup bag. I love it. It fits literally everything I ever need in life in this one bag. So I guess we'll start with the primer, right? Like we should go in order. That makes the most sense. There's so much stuff in this bag. So the first thing that I put on my face would be the Smashbox color correcting primer. Um, I get very, very, very red very easily. So this is the best to combat redness. And yeah, I've used this literally forever. Honestly, everything that I use, I've used for like t 10 years at this point. I like, don't really change my makeup often. Um, if it's not broke, don't fix it, I guess is like the right saying for that. So this is the first thing I use. And then after that, I go in with foundation, which I literally have like 15 different foundations that I use on like a daily basis. These are the four of what I use, depending on if I have a spray tan or not, I'll use, well, I use Urban Decay's All Nighter. I also use Kat Von D's like Locket foundation, I think it's called. And then I also have Elf's Flawless Foundation. So I'll like mix all of these together. Um, if I have a spray tan, it would be the two darker shades um, and also this darker shade. And then depending on how pale I am, right now I'm really pale, I would just use the Urban Decay, which is just in shade two. And if I need it a little bit darker, I'll like mix in the e.l.f. So it's literally science is basically what I'm trying to say. I mix all of those together on a daily basis. Um, let me see what you guys are saying before I just keep babbling on. Ooh, thank you. I also love my nails too. I got them done like right before I came to LA. They're just like red. And then this one looks like a sweater. <laughs> um, hi. Yes, this is the white shirt that I did in the haul the other day. I'm like running out of clothes because I've been in LA for so long. So now I'm like wearing the clothes that I bought while I was in LA. Makes sense. Um, and then after I do my foundation, that's when I'm going to do my eyes. So I know people kind of do it differently, but after I do my foundation is when I do my eyes. And I don't know, I'm not that amazing at eyeshadow, honestly, but I try my best. Um, the two palettes that I use the most would be the Morphe Jeffree Star one and the James Charles one. These are the two that I honestly use pretty much every day. I use this one more every day, but I also do use this one. I normally use like the brownish tones the most. Oh God, this is, I don't know what I'm gonna do. So yeah, I normally would use like the, that brown, as you can see, I use it a lot. I use this brown a lot. I know they have names. Sorry, I don't know. <laughs> Actually, I can figure out the names. I can do this. Um, so Good is the gold one that I use, and then Benny is like the dark brown that I use. Also, T, 
is one that I use a lot too. Oh my God, there's one called No Beans. Oh my God, I didn't know that. And then Ring Light is one that I use on my inner corner like a lot, a lot, a lot. And then out of the Morphe and Jeffree Star palette, the one that I, the ones that I use the most, I don't even know if I could probably say the names that he has of some of these on camera. Um, I use Welcome a lot, which is like this silvery shade. I also use, mm, I guess that's really, well, I also use Lynn. I use Lynn as like a base color a lot, as well as designer label, and I think this is custom rims. Oh my god. This is why I'm not a beauty guru, like, ever in life. Um, thank you guys. You guys are so sweet. I don't do any makeup, but I always find myself on these videos. I am horrible at makeup, so glad we could be awful together. So then after I do my eyes, um, also a huge, like, hack that I always use is Always use tape to make like the line up. I could never do it by myself. I could never like just freehand it. Couldn't be me. So I use tape um, always. It's like my like biggest little tip if you need one. It's the only one I probably have. And if you don't have tape, I actually use like a card. This is like a really old Panera card. Um, and like you literally just put it like right there and like the gosh. So that's what I normally do. And then after eyeshadow would be when I do my concealer. I also use Urban Decay's All Nighter Concealer. Um, I'll just put that like under my eyes, on the bridge of my nose, sometimes on my forehead, depending. But yeah, so, oh God, there's like fuzz on my nose now. Um, but yeah, this is something that I've also used forever and they just, just changed it recently, which I was really upset about, but it's fine. And I use like the little Real Techniques. It's so dirty, I'm so sorry. I should really clean it. But Real Techniques is the beauty blender thing that I use. After that, I will do my powder. I've used this MAC Studio Fix powder since literally the day I was born. I've never changed it. I've never done anything different. I've never done like loose powder. This is just always the one that I've used. Like I said, if it's not broke, don't fix it. So I always use this. I kind of just like focus it where I put the concealer and just kind of brush it everywhere to like set everything. And then after that is when I will start to contour. I'm trying to find all my things. Um, and I've used Anastasia's Contour Kit Forever. I also used to use NARS Laguna for a really, really, really long time. But um, I kind of just go through with all the ones on the bottom. Like I take my contour brush and just like do all of them. And I'll contour everywhere pretty much um and then after i contour if i can find it i go in with my blush i have also used this blush forever it's from mac and it's called warm soul it's just like a really nice warm shimmery blush so love this and what would i do next i would do blush oh and then i guess highlighter this is the Kylie Cosmetics one. I know it doesn't even look like it anymore because I've had it forever. I don't even know what color it is because I can't see what it says on the back. But um, once I'm done with this one, I would be open to trying different highlighters. So if you guys have any suggestions of highlighters that I should use, let me know because I don't know what I'm going to do after this one. And I don't even know what color this is to like, reorder it. So let me know any really good highlighters because I definitely need suggestions. Um, and then after highlighter, I guess I would do either eyebrows or eyeliner, I guess. Oh my god, my friend's trying to call me right now. Hold on. Are you watching my live? I literally knew it. Hi. I love learning about your makeup tips. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Oh my god, I can hear myself. That's weird. Thank you. Do you want to say hi? Hi, everybody. <laughs> All right. Okay. Love you. Bye. So, if anyone doesn't know who that is, um, that's my friend Ivan. I accidentally released his number one time in a video, uh, completely on accident. So, uh, sorry about that, Ivan. Love you. Where even was I at this point? Was I on eyebrows or eyeliner? I think both. I think I was talking about both, honestly. Oh my god, I didn't even talk about that I prime my eyes before I do eyeshadow with the Morphe primer. Whatever. 
Um, and then if I were to do eyebrows next, I use Anastasia's Ebony Brow Powder Duo. Brows stress me out endlessly. I hate them. They're the most difficult part of a makeup routine in my opinion. So that's just, if anyone has any tips on eyebrows, let me know. Um, and then I would do eyeliner. Sometimes I don't do eyeliner, but like if I do, it would be this one. It's the Kat Von D something or other. And then I would normally put lashes on. I don't have like any lashes right now, but I use the, oh my God, which ones do I use? They're the, the faux mink. I think they're by Kiss. Are they by Ardell? I think they're by Ardell. I don't know. I don't know why I can't think of this right now, but they're the faux mink in the demi wispy shape. And then I'll always go over with this. This is the Hourglass Caution Extreme Lash Mascara. I've been loving this so, 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 so much. It makes my lashes look so good. You're probably like, oh, your lashes look awful right now. But I swear, this makes them look so good. And then I guess, is that everything? Like, is that everything I do? I think so. Because there's nothing else in my bag. Um, and then I would just go over with lip gloss. Lip gloss is my favorite. I'm not a big lipstick girl or like matte lipstick or anything like that. Not my thing. But I love lip gloss. So this is probably like this. I like ColourPop, but I also really like the Buxom uh, lip gloss. It's like probably my favorite. And yeah, I think that's like really everything I use. I'm like going through like, wow. If only, it if only like it took me as long as it took me to say it to like do it. It takes me like an hour to do my makeup and I don't even know why like I feel like I don't do that much but it just takes me forever um I guess now you guys can like ask me some questions if you have any questions for me like a little Q and A also it doesn't have to be about makeup it could be about anything but have you ever tried red aspen lashes I actually have not where do they sell them or like what do they look like because I love lashes. Like lashes are probably my favorite part of a makeup tutorial. Makeup tutorial, just like a makeup look is my point. Um, I love lashes. Okay, let's see what you guys are saying. Hi, you're one of my favorite YouTubers to watch. Oh, thank you so much. Um, thank you for all your hard work this year during Vlogmas. Vlogmas has been hard, guys. Um, Vlogmas is just a lot, and I say this every single year. Like, if, if any of you have watched past Vlogmases, every year around this time, it gets really hard. But I go back home today, and then I have, like, a lot more content planned, like, when I go back home. So things are going to get better. <laughs> you can only get them online. It's direct sales company, I think. Oh, cool. I will definitely check them out. But yeah, I mean, that's really it. I just wanted to come on live and kind of do, like this was the video that I was going to always post today. I was going to do kind of like a everyday makeup, like what I use every single day routine type thing. Um, but like I said, I am leaving to the airport and I knew by the time I filmed everything, edited, got it up, it just wouldn't be as good as I wanted it to be. So I thought I could literally do what I was gonna do in a video, but just on live for you guys. And it's more fun because I can like actually talk to you and like see what you're saying. Um, while I go on live. Last question, can you do another TikTok video? Oh, TikTok? You don't understand. This is like my new favorite thing. TikTok is consuming my life at this point. Um, if you guys don't know, I recently just made a TikTok. I'm t almost gonna be 22 years old and I have a TikTok. It's like not normal. But uh, yeah, I could do another TikTok video for Or TikToks or like make more TikToks like on my channel. Honestly, I'll probably do both. Maybe I can like do a TikTok video like I did the other day, but like maybe have like my mom learn them with me or something. I think that would be really funny because she would have no idea what's going on. And if she's watching this live right now, she's probably like, uh, what? But yeah, it'd be really fun if I did a TikTok video, like learning TikTok dances, but with my mom. Can you please do your makeup already? I'm not doing it. I just wanted to like show you guys the products I use. I'm not like actually doing my makeup. I'm sorry. Um, can you do a Target vlog? 
I can. I could definitely go to Target. Um, Target's like one of my places to buy things at, especially during the holidays. So um, what time will you be live tomorrow? I don't think I'm going to go live tomorrow. I will have a video up tomorrow. It'll probably be East Coast time, like evening around. Um, since I've been on the West Coast lately, my times have been a little different. So that's why like that's kind of been like that. But it'll probably be up evening, but it won't, it'll be like a normal video. It won't, it won't be a live video, but, um, I will definitely do more of these with you guys. If you want me to, I feel like when I go on live, sometimes I'm like, I don't know what to talk about, but I can really just come on here and talk to you guys. So, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, this will be up as a normal video, which is so weird. So I feel like I could like close it out as a normal video. But then also it's alive right now, so like I never really understand how that works. But um, if you watched me live, then thank you guys. Or if you're watching it days later, hours later, whatever, um, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like the video and comment down below like your favorite makeup items or like what you, if you, I don't know. It's so weird because, like, normally if I was filming and editing, I would, like, cut that out and, like, whatever. But um, we're live, so I can't. But thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, bye. Have a good night. You have a good night, too. Thank you for watching. But, like I said, uh, where was I? I don't even know. Subscribe. Turn on post notifications so you never miss anything during Vlogmas. We are on day 15. There are only 10 days left. There's 10 days left till Christmas. That's crazy. Oh my God. I like didn't even realize that. Um, but I will see you guys tomorrow with a brand new video. Comment down below maybe what you want to see. I don't know. Um, I love you guys. Thank you for watching. And I will see you tomorrow. And this is normally when the end slate would play, but there isn't one. <laughs> Bye guys.